hello guys welcome to another video tutorial in this video I'm gonna teach with you how you can make countdown timer in jQuery so this is a very simple project I will use jQuery and also bootstrap to design the project okay guys so let's get started to create the project I go to my code editor inside my code editor I have uh, one file index.html and two folders CSS and JS inside the JS uh, CSS folder I will include the bootstrap file so I go to my desktop and uh, basically I will download this bootstrap file okay I write bootstrap and download the bootstrap file click to download download that and then you need to select the location or path the countdown timer this is my project and open the folder and right click it and extract here and we need to just copy the bootstrap CSS file and paste to your CSS folder inside the CSS folder and remove those folders now the next thing we need to download jQuery so I use jQuery and we need to download that download and select all and go to your code editor inside your JS folder you need to make a file write any name as you like in my case I use jQuery.js we need to include those files first one is a bootstrap CSS file okay this is a my folder name inside my folder name have a bootstrap.css file we need to include also jQuery file so I use script src js and jQuery right then we will create another file I will include the main.js file I will create this file inside the js folder main.js file right now the next thing we need to download the jQuery project countdown timer project so I'm gonna go to Google and search on the address bar jQuery countdown timer and open the third one link like this the final countdown jQuery dot countdown and download this project select your location or path open the folder and then right click it and then extract here remove zip folder and go to jQuery countdown select any one file as you like in my case I use jQuery dot countdown timer and paste inside the JS folder and also you need to remove this folder from your project you need to include this file so I use script src JS and countdown timer right we need to include this file I mean uh, open this file inside this file we need to copy the simple code like this copy that and go to your code editor and paste the file uh, I mean code cut this div also ID paste inside your index dot HTML file and go to main.js file remove script code and also this one okay this is a year I will use 220 2020 and 12 this is a year countdown timer okay and this is a basically month and this is a date so first save that and right click it and let's check it now on the browser Okay, I think something is wrong. 
uh, jQuery uh, I just cut that and paste here there we go guys we are able to see 65 days 0 0 and this is a basically time okay now I want to use this project first time I'm gonna show with you this is a day I'm gonna remove day so I just remove that day day hours minute and seconds okay save that okay day minutes seconds I mean hours minute and seconds if I change that if I change that basically I wanna use uh, let's check it now right okay I want to design this project so what I can do guys we need to use uh, put it to classes first I'm gonna show with you guys just a minute I use a div class container inside container div I gonna use class row class call lg8 m auto and card and then card title I'm gonna use card editor and inside so the card editor I use jQuery countdown timer right then I will use uh, div body I mean card body inside the card body I will use table class and tr td first one I'm gonna show with you this then mm, no hours minutes and then seconds right first save that and let's check it now on the browser okay uh, I will uh, use basically bg dark and text white text also center okay okay now the next thing we need to use tr td and we need to assign just IDs day hours minute and seconds okay and also I will assign the class like display for copy that test test and paste right and finally you need to go on jQuery main.js file this is a basically this section I'm gonna show with you just a minute this is a basically one section I want to display only days so I just cut that save that and go to browser as you can see this right so I will use same thing but I undo that and I copy it paste here paste paste okay inside this section I just assign the ID first one is a day this one okay I remove the another values 
inside the second one I need to just assign the second one ID like uh, hovers and I remove other one without hovers right you same thing and copy the third one is uh, basically minute and remove those values without minutes and third one is a seconds and final is a seconds okay save that and let's check out on the browser as you can see guys okay now the next thing is uh, I'm gonna use table script and I'm gonna use pg dot card body okay guys so now the next I will assign the student day I'm gonna use bg dog text white right so I copy that and paste it okay guys so this is our simple project do you want to change the uh, values for example I want to first I'm gonna show with you guys just a minute I go to jkiri.com.js file inside this file here there are many ways I mean many features available like years months days days to month days to week 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 to month hours you can select any one as you like for example I'm gonna show with you guys just a minute this is a uh, basically hovers I mean days I want to show month okay so I just change the ID month and also bit and just change the month right and go to main.js file and copy this one target your ID this one ID okay this one and go to jquery.countdown and select the month to like this M so I just use small M cell as you can see guys 9 months 284 days 0, 0 hours 4 minutes and 7 6 seconds you can design that your own behalf I just tell you how you can create that so thank you very much for watching please subscribe my channel for getting updates have a nice day guys